it's Linda Medeiros, director with The Pampered Chef. And uh, what's Linda cooking? I am making um, some split pea soup because I had a little bit of the pork tazza left over. My mother loves split pea soup. I have a little bit of split peas here. So I'm gonna make a nice little uh, split pea soup for, uh, just very quick, for dinner. So I've got here just some carrots that I'm chopping up with the food chopper. And then some onion. So we're chopping that up right there. And I'm actually going to put a little bit of oil in here. And I'm using my quick cooker, of course, because that's what's going to be done in like half hour, 20 minutes, something like that. So we're going to put all this in, start the sauteing process. Whoa, hopefully it won't. won't. Yep, okay. There we go. I didn't spill any. That is amazing. So I just figured. I would do this, it would be a nice lunch kind of thing. And now I have the pork tazo here, and who knows if this will chop it. Oh, it is, so that's good. So, just gonna like, just chop this up, just to go in. Now, if you are vegan, or you are vegetarian, you're not going to use the ham. You're gonna use just some, uh, some veggie stock, that's it. Um, and, you know, and it'll make a nice uh, split pea soup, okay? I have a lot of friends who are plant-based, and beans are like one of the best things anyways. They store really, really well, they're easy to cook, especially when you have the quick cooker, which is the electric pressure cooker. So, I'm going to put this in here. Now, I do not have any celery. So I'm probably gonna use some celery salt in there just to kind of simulate that. I've got some garlic, and I'm just gonna put the garlic in my garlic press. There we go. Oh, I need my knife. There we go. Let me stir that around a little bit. There we go, I got my crusty. Oh, a stowaway there, we're gonna throw that in now. Now, we've got split pea and I've got water. Again, you can use um, chicken stock if you want or ham stock or they have these nice little packets of ham stock. Agoya makes it and it's called like a ham flavoring. If you are vegan or if you are vegetarian, there's something called liquid smoke you can put in there that gives it that nice smoky flavor so that it will simulate kind of that ham kind of a taste if you want that. Um, when I was vegetarian, that's what I would do. Um, this is probably gonna take about a half an hour to kind of come together. I'm gonna add some of that celery salt. I'm also gonna add some bay leaves, and I always have these in my, in my pantry. Because, and you can, then you're gonna take them out afterwards because you don't want anybody eating this because um, it'll get stuck in their throat. Um, but it flavors your soups and your stews um, really, really well. So uh, bay leaf is always something that I have, and uh, that's pretty much it. Uh, this is all gonna come together, and like I said, about 20 minutes, half an hour, uh, it's gonna be done. So split pea soup, easy, and to me, any kind of bean soup, easy to do, fast, when you have the pressure cooker, the, the quick cooker, it is my go-to appliance for that kind of stuff. So we are just going to dump, the split peas in there, and then the water, Ooh, and my stock. And then like I said, I'm gonna put some celery salt in it, put it all together, and it will be done. I will put a picture in the comments so that you can see it when it's all done, but this is uh, gonna be so delicious, and I know my mother's gonna love it. Um, and uh, I'm gonna love it too. Probably with maybe some bread or some croutons in it or something like that. It is gonna be amazing. So, that's it for now. Let me know what you're cooking because I always like to hear what everybody is cooking. Or if you have some kind of a, a product that you, or a food that is in your pantry that you don't know how to cook or you don't know what to do with it, drop me a comment or send me a private message and I'll try to help you out with it with some recipes and, and so forth. So uh, if you are watching this, please share, like, comment. If you're watching it on YouTube, please subscribe. Even if you're not watching it on YouTube, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. 
and share it. And uh, that's it for now. This is Linda Medeiros. I hope you're safe and I hope you're comfortable in your house. Um, and if you are a uh, an essential worker, God bless you and uh, stay safe, everybody. Uh, bye for now. And I have to do my little, Whoa! okay, bye.